Welcome, welcome. My name is Linda Lowen and I am the host of 4 Minute Friday. During the next four minutes, I will explore what I think is an interesting topic. It could be a thought, an idea, a new invention, or something about new technology. I could be talking about life, our community, the world, or the future. Whatever the topic, my hope is it will give us something to think about and perhaps start a conversation. This is 4 Minute Friday and the 4 Minutes starts right now. Technology is evolving in every industry. So far on these 4 Minute Fridays, I've mostly spoken of different ways to reduce and utilize waste in manufacturing. Today I want to explore a totally different subject that is close to my heart. We're going to be talking music. Over the years, technology has also changed music. Let's take a quick look at the history of music and how much it has changed over the millennia. The language of music is over 200,000 years old. Ancient music likely began with the percussive sounds like beating of rocks and sticks. It took over 190,000 years for the first ancient instruments to come into existence. Drums appeared as far back as 6,000 BCE. But it would be another 2,000 years before the first instruments, like the harp and the flute, emerged. Progress then seemed to speed up. Another 500 years and new string instruments, the lyre and double reed wind instruments, emerged. Another thousand years and the natural trumpet began to appear. We'll go yet another thousand years and an instrument we recognize, the lute, was introduced. This instrument is considered to be the first guitar. A new system of writing music was developed 1500 years ago. 400 years later, Guido de Arezzo made music easier by adding time signatures and music notation. He also invented solfege. That's a fancy word for saying the vocal scale as we know it. Do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, ti, do. Though the organ dates back as far as 250 BCE, the clavichords, or the early piano, only appeared during the Renaissance. As we move from the Renaissance through the various musical periods of Baroque, Classical, Romantic, Music is made with string, wind, and percussion instruments. It is in the past hundred years with the harnessing of electricity and technology that instruments of the past have been transformed into modern electric and now electronic versions. This brings me to that which inspired this episode of 4 Minute Friday. My daughter showed me a music video. I was mesmerized. I had not seen anything like it before. Today I would like to introduce you to Imogen Heap. She is not only a musician, but also a pioneer of electropop and a technology developer. To be able to provide a more entertaining show, Imogen has designed and created an extremely unique pair of gloves called Mimu. The gloves are made with sensors and LED lights that track any motion of the hand, of the arm, and even the entire body. Connected wirelessly to the software system, each motion relates to a different sound, whether that is adding harmonies to the voice, creating effects on instrumental sounds, or adding percussive beats to the mix. The sound can even pan from one side of the auditorium to another with a wave of her arms. Looping of sounds, pitch, volume, sound effects, special effects, stop, continue, are all controlled by these gloves. Let's go back to the beginning of music. The modern day instruments we now play have evolved over 18,000 of those years. Fast forward to today, it was a mere 10 years ago that these Mimu gloves were introduced and the advances in technology have allowed for great improvements since then. The Mimu gloves truly make motion the music. Imogen Heap has appeared on several TEDx talks since 2011. I will add some YouTube links in the description. I would love to hear what you think of the music and how the Mimu gloves make that music. Thank you so much for listening. 
I hope you enjoyed this episode of 4 Minute Friday. Please leave a comment below or subscribe to the channel. Until next week, this is Linda Lowen signing off. Have a great weekend.